Taking up your meditation posture, maintaining a straight spine, because we must always begin with the attitude that enables us to continue our practice. Hold your chin slightly inwards, so your crown is pointing towards the ceiling. Imagine you're being held upright by a piece of invisible string. And it feels so effortless to hold your spine straight. Position your arms wherever you feel comfortable. And your hands wherever you feel comfortable. On your knees. Resting on your lap. We must always try to find that balance in our bodies between feeling comfortable and alert. Close your eyes softly and relax your face, your cheeks, your mouth, your tongue and the point between your eyebrows. And hold your awareness on the gentle rhythms of the breathing body. For a few moments, you may breathe more heavily if that helps to draw you in. Notice the rising and falling of the chest, the sensation in the nostrils as the breath enters and leaves your body. And don't worry if the mind distracts you and pulls you away by bringing all thoughts and ideas to you right now. The mind is just doing its job, what comes naturally to it, trying to keep you engaged with it at all times. Notice the mind pulling you away from the breathing body. All you need to do is acknowledge it. Acknowledge it, but bring your awareness back. Acknowledge it, bring your awareness back. That's all, over and over again, until slowly the distractions become fewer. And bring with you an open mind, a inquiry that enables you to commit as fully as you are able for now, right now. This meditation is inspired by the Baha'i teachings who has taught generations past and present this. Nature, in its essence, is the embodiment of the Creator. Its manifestations are diversified by varying causes and in this diversity, There are signs of discernment for all of us. Nature is God's will, that which is expressed in and through the contingent world. Connecting with nature is also a meditation practice in its own right. You may wish to meditate in nature or visualize nature in your practice. Nature is the embodiment of the Creator. Who will embody today in this practice? Begin by bringing your awareness to the ground beneath you and the support provides you always and unconditionally. Breathe into the ground. Root your body into its strength, your connection to it. Complete, whole, and in this moment, you are grounded by its unwavering resolve. Visualize that mountain again, just one more time. But this time, you are not simply on the mountain. You are. The mountain. 
the essence of the mountain. You as this mountain are a monument to all that is solid, stable, grand, unmoving, full. Are there trees there? Perhaps waterfalls cascading as mists into an open sky. Creatures who live there. Snow blankets. Rustling leaves. However it is, be as it is. A perfect living thing of creation just as you are. Be this mountain, share in its stillness. Grounded in your posture, your head its skyward peak, supported by the rest of your base. Granting you an awe-inspiring perspective before you, behind you and about you which flows from your centre into the distant horizon. You are this mountain, and take the as your own. From the top of your crown, down your neck, and into the balance of your shoulders, like cliffs descending into your arms and forearms, and in the valley of your hands, you are this mountain your feet, legs and hips at its base, solid and rooted beneath you. A foundation up your spine and abdomen, a core of stability. The rhythm of your breath is all that moves you, a living mountain, alive and aware, yet unwell, in inner stillness, completely what you are beyond words and thoughts, a centred, grounded, unmovable presence. You are a mountain which witnesses the sun travel across the sky, casting light and shadows and colours across its consistent composure. Moment by moment, in the mountain stillness, the surface bustles with life and activity. Blooming, waning, blooming. You are the mountain. Who will be called beautiful and inspiring and dark and ominous. And knows that it is all of those things and less. Which sits and sees how night follows day and back again. Which knows the sun by the warmth it brings on rising, and the stars by the way they show and sky. Through it all, the mountain sits, aware of the changes that each moment brings, around it and to it. Yet it remains still, as the seasons flow into one another, as the air swirls from hot to cold and back again. It is you are still. None of this concerns the mountain, whose serenity is housed within. It cannot be disturbed by fleeting furor. In the same way as you sit in meditation today, you can learn to experience the mountain as a means to embody the unwavering stillness and sense of grounding and stability in the face of all the changes in your life over seconds, hours, days. Weeks, years. Be still. You are the mountain. Embody. Embody the essence of the mountain.
for a few more moments. And as we close, remember this, like the mountain, you will experience the changing nature of your mind and of the world around you. You will have moments varying in intensity, darkness and light, activity and inactivity, and moments that fill your life with colour. Through it all, be the mountain and call on its patience, strength, and stability within you. Let it empower you to encounter each with mindful composure and compassionate clarity as an eternal witness. very gently and slowly when you feel ready you can disassemble your meditation posture and bring your awareness back into the space around you by slowly and softly opening your eyes thank you